Hi gang, welcome back to The Splainer. I'm Austin Davis. Let's jump into the deep end with Regina's 2019 approved budget. You know, it'd be nice if we had a more appropriate setting for this. Right on. I can work on my tan. Regina has five outdoor pools that operate for about three months each year. Not one of them was built after the moon landing. Forced to choose between adding to an already unpopular tax increase or ignoring the tears of children, City Council avoided both by voting to replace Maple Leaf Pool without specifying a way to pay for it. That's likely a $4.5 million commitment. The City says the current 73-year-old Maple Leaf Pool cannot safely be opened in 2019, and the 72-year-old Wascana Pool can't operate past 2019. So the city proposed to permanently close Maple Leaf Pool and make a new outdoor destination aquatic facility in Wascana Center. While some residents were celebrating a possible water slide, the Heritage neighborhood was mobilizing. Wait a sec. This sounds familiar. In 2013, the city planned to close two of the outdoor pools. There was public uproar, Heritage folks froze in their bathing suits, and the city backed down. Mayor Michael Fougere said at the time, I think it's safe to say we hit a nerve. Dot, dot, dot. We're not closing pools. So the city opted to wait until 2018 to move forward with its plan, spending at least a couple hundred thousand dollars each year to keep the crumbling pools going in the meantime. The passage of time did not change the public reaction to proposed pool closures. Is anybody surprised? I'd like to say we're all learning from the past, but this one has me wondering, was it all a dream? dream? dream?